Hey there guys, Anime Fate here, back again. So, I went on a little trip, and I picked up some stuff while I was gone. Uh, most of it is pop, but one or two things aren't. So, let's get started. So, starting with our pop figures, we have, and spoiler alert here, Dragon Ball Super. If you have not watched it, and you do not know this character... Stop before I start explaining. Get out. Go watch another video. Go go watch some. And then come on back. Okay. I, I don't want to ruin it for you guys. And I don't want y'all to be like. Whoa. Who's this? Or you know. Rage out on me. Okay. So. This is. The Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black Pop figure. It's the Hot Topic exclusive. I'm pretty sure. That uh, most hot topics will be carrying them by now. But so here's the side. And then here's the back. And I want to make a point. Usually they have like the other characters you can purchase, but on this one, they don't. Then that hints to me that either he is either going to be the only one or that they're still making them and this is kind of like a tester, which is what I'm thinking. So let's go ahead and open it on up. Get him out of there. Alright, there he is. It's pretty cool. So, here's his little energy blade, whatever you want to call it. And then, I like how he has a little fusion earring. Like, he's about to fuse, fuse with Zamas or Zamasu, however you like to say it. Anyways, let you guys get a good look at him. Alright, next one up, this is, right now, one of my favorite animes. I, I'm trying to catch up, so again, spoiler alert, if you don't know what I'm about to be talking about, go watch some stuff and then come on back. I just, again, I don't want to ruin it for you guys. But, what I have here is the Armored Titan. Super cool. It's from Attack on Titan. Uh, so you guys get a side picture here. And then all the characters. So here you have Female Titan, Armor Titan, Levy, Annie, Armin, Sasha, and then what I like is Cleaning Levy. Nice little close up on that. Alright. Let's get her on open. Alright, so. Here is the Armor Titan. This guy's pretty wicked looking. He's got the teeth. And he's got like the jaw piece that uh, links up. Side. Alright, so I want to make a point at this. Look at the detail in this. Every little line, every little, I don't know if you guys can see it, little muscle stretch in there. Just the amount of detail that are that is put into these pop figures is just amazing. And the last one, which I, I am really, really happy about. I found this inside the store. And this is actually from my very first anime. This is actually what got me into anime. Uh, when I was a kid, uh, I, you know, anime wasn't really a thing. I mean, you had like Dragon Ball. You had a few shows out. But the one that really caught my interest at the start was Naruto. Naruto has always been a favorite of mine. Ever since, I think it was episode 14, when Naruto went Ninetales for the very first time. When I saw that, it just, it got me. You know, seeing the red chakra, the wolf, or the, I'm sorry, <laughs> sorry. Uh, the fox head, uh, him going from 
man to beast, losing all of his uh, his humanity and reverting back to the savage beast. At least that's the way I looked at it. Anyway, so you guys get a side view of that. And then, there you go. So there's Kurama, Naruto, and then Sasuke. So let's get him on open. I, I am honestly, I love this so much. I love how the ears go up. Uh, the little teeth, the little nose, how he, uh, how his eyebrows come down here and actually visually shows that it stops. They come out a little bit. Little claws. I'll hold that back so you guys can see that. And get a side view. And a back view with all one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tails. So that are that's the uh, three pop figures I got this time. I'm really, I'm really really happy about this. Uh, so on to the next one, or I'm sorry. Well, there's no more pop. On to the next thing though. Let me those. Uh, now I have already taken it out of the packaging. Sorry, but uh. I can still tell you what it is. It is a uh, StarCraft USB charger. Now, I got this at uh, GameStop, but it's by a company called ThinkGeek. I, I, re I really like them. They're, uh, for those of you out there who are super nerds and what you, what you consider super nerds, this is the place to go. They have everything. From Legend of Zelda light up things to the Legend of Zelda wristwatch. You can get the Master Sword. They have everything there. If it's anime or video games, they probably got it. But so here's what it looks like. Doesn't look like much, I know. But it's 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 super cool. So here it's got a uh for those of you who actually know what this means, it's got a 5V to a 2.5A. That's the type of plug-in, so if you ever damage the plug, this is what you're looking for. So I'll plug that in. Now, I don't really have anything to show you how it charges, but uh, it's actually really cool. So I'm going to demonstrate what it does here. So I'm going to... well. We're about to go dark in three, two, one. Ready, guys? Look at that. I know it's not much, but I love it. it it's just a little thing I can have by my bed at night, charge up my stuff, not, not having to worry about all the surge protectors and how far my cord reaches. I can set this thing up next to me. I don't have to go to bed. I can just set it up here next to my bed, or on my bed, have, it's got two USBs, so one on this side, one on this side, and I can charge my stuff while I'm sitting here watching TV or something. And then, so I'm gonna turn that back on. Yeah, so honestly, I think it was worth it. Uh, so yeah. So, that's all for this video. Uh, if you like the video, please thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Anime Fate out.